Alright, so now you're gonna add the utility shape to call the create operator activity. So we just create it. Pass in the parameters dot email and dot first name. And arrows so sign up create the operator so now you want to add the decision shape if registration is successful go to the next stage if not go to the next step so change to next stage so we want to say if if create operator was successful go to next stage otherwise go to unsuccessful registration so last if you go configure the decision shape Set to boolean, and yes, take the expression of flag. So dot flag equals equals to one. Test it. If one contains here, false. Nothing. It's true. Submit. Submit. If flag is equal to one, we're gonna go to the next stage, and it should be because create operator makes flag equal to one. So result equal to true. If it's not equal to one, if it's failed, then it should be false or else. And save. Refresh your case type. Save and run. Continue. We can now check and see if our operator ID has been created by going to Records, Organization, Operator ID, and then it should be the latest one. You might need to hit refresh in order to see the latest eight changes.